Hey guys! Tara from White Stag Art here. These are my new paintings. They are the first two paintings of 2016. They are titled Salt and Pepper. Now, the first uh, sketch I actually did was Pepper, but for some reason I ended up just wanting to do two, and it ended up being Salt and Pepper. However, Pepper's original title was going to be Salt, because I, I was thinking Ocean, Sea, first thing that came to mind was Salt. I have been in an extreme nautical mood, and there's a ton of other paintings I want to do with the kind of ocean theme, but I should probably like back off and do something else. Like, it's winter, why do I want to do nautical stuff? I don't know. Like, maybe I should just go with it. Because I have been, I wouldn't call it artist block, because I have an endless amount of ideas, but I'm just not excited to work on anything, so it's actually been, I haven't even been streaming as much, because it's like, I'm not excited to work on anything, it's just the inspiration isn't quite there, even though I have the ideas, it's just I don't necessarily feel like working on those ones. Now for these paintings, I kept changing the background again, because that's like, I wasn't entirely sure what I wanted to do. But I do that with water all the time. Like, I, every time I paint water, I do it so infrequently anymore, I forget how I paint it. So I kind of have to fudge around with it and figure out what route I'm going. Whether or not I'm going to do a darker tone ocean background or a lighter one. And things kind of change in how I handle it, like, a lot. And I do apologize because I have not had any videos for a while. And it's crazy. Like, I am still getting caught up from uh, the holidays. Like, I just kind of got backlogged and piecing together my last painting for the video. That took a long while. And then here I had this video all done, ready to do the voice editing. And, well, the voiceover work anyway, and I'm going through it, and I was just missing this whole big chunk. So I had to go find what stream that was and render that a few times to time lapse it. So that took even longer than I thought it was going to. I have also been working on another painting and stream uh, with a medic girl and like a mushroom cloud in the background, but I'm not feeling it. Like, it is almost done, but I think I'm going to move on to something else, so I don't know when the next finished painting video will be, because I don't have anything, like, kind of going on right now other than that painting. I'm hoping to start something new tonight and stream, which my schedule is all messed up. Like, I know I was thinking about taking Tuesdays off as well, and just streaming on Twitch on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. But I ended up not streaming last night, so I'm going to stream tonight. And I gotta think of something amazing I want to do. I have several ideas, but I want to work kind of small, and I want to save the 8x10s kind of for like portrait style stuff anyway. I don't have a lot of 8x10 paintings roaming around at the moment, but I have a ton of bigger stuff, so I should kind of work small. So hopefully, after this video, I will be sketching and trying to figure out what I'll be painting tonight. And I can probably take that sketch video and throw it up on here as well, because I don't think I've posted any sketch videos for a little bit. In the past, when I would finish a painting, I'd like immediately go scan it in, take pictures, get it posted, at least by the next day. But it's like I've been waiting even as long as like a week or more to release paintings after I finish them. Part of the reason is I want to make sure it's done. Like I've gotten done with a painting and it's just sometimes like an aspect would bother me and it could be like a day later or a week later. And I don't want to wait till after I've already released it. Like, I want it to make sure it's done. I want to hold myself to a higher standard of art and make sure I'm happy with it. 
Now granted, I'm not going to like it in two to three years because my chat, my style is constantly evolving and changing. Every painting I do is a learning process and I get better. So I will be probably like 10 times better at painting in three to five years. And anything I did before that is just going to be like, nah, I can't believe I released that. You know, I'm, I'm already like that now with all my older stuff. I've been slowly trying to make it disappear from Etsy shop. You know, there's probably like a hundred and some paintings that I've just flat out retired. I don't want to look at anymore, even though they were really, really good sellers and prints. So I should be able to get at least a sketch video up here soon, even though I might not be able to do the finished painting video in a little bit. And hopefully also be seeing tutorials. Like I should have the figure drawing one done soon and probably do a second part to the hand video I did a while back for drawing. And I will be streaming tonight on Twitch. Uh, you can come hang out, lurk, chat with me while I'm painting on something new. Uh, if you subscribe to me on Twitch, if you enable the notifications you'll get an email when I go live or you can also follow me on Twitter and it should tweet when I go live. Sometimes it, it doesn't always work, but it should tweet. Now my Twitch name is Vitstag, H-V-I-T-S-T-A-G. You can find the link below this video in the, in the description and at the end of the video. Uh, if you like what you see, subscribe here on YouTube. I post more videos frequently. I've been a little behind since the holidays, but it should start picking up here shortly. And I have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you know, all those fun social media things. So thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.